This AI turns your photo into a movie, adds movement and sound, even lets your character talk. Here's how to use Google VO3 to animate a character in different scenes and control everything. In some scenes, you want to show your character from different angles or positions. Or you may need to place the same character in completely different environments while keeping the clothing and style consistent. To generate the images, I used Crea AI. And to edit those images, like adjusting camera angles or placing the character in new scenes, I used Flux Context. Just upload your image, describe what you want, and let it do its magic. If you want a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to use Flux Context for image generation and editing, check out this video on my channel. Once your images are ready, you can enhance their quality with upscaling tools like Leonardo AI for clearer and more detailed visuals. For video generation, I use Google Flow. VO3 now supports image to video generation with built-in audio. It gives you much more control by allowing you to use your own images to create consistent characters and scenes in different shots. Sometimes the platform doesn't show your previously uploaded image or the upload fails and shows an error. If this happens, just use a VPN and connect with a USIP address that usually solves the problem. You can select first and last frames of your video, but if you want to generate a video with audio, you need to use VO3. If you select both the first and last frames, you need to switch to VO2, which doesn't support audio. If you upload image and try to use a pre-made camera motion, the same thing happens, and it will switch you to VO2. To keep using VO3 with audio, just upload your first frame and describe the camera motion in your prompt. I'll show you exactly how to do that in the next section. VO3 Fast Mode uses 20 credits and VO3 Quality Mode uses 100 credits. I didn't see much difference between them for most prompts. After generating your video, you can add it to the Scene Builder. This tool gives you more control over your storytelling, whether you're extending a scene or creating a timeline with multiple shots. However, the Extend option isn't supported on VO3. To extend your video, you can save the last frame of your video and use it to generate the next part. It's over! You must pay for what you did! This is the path you chose. There was nothing I could do. Once you've created your scenes, you can rearrange them in any order. You can also remove any shot you don't want. Then just press the download button to export your final video with all the scenes together. If you want your character to speak with a specific accent, be sure to mention it clearly in your prompt. Excuse me, do you know which way I should go to get to the water? Hey, do you know which way I should go to get to the water? If you haven't specified an accent and the AI unexpectedly adds one, This isn't the end. I'll make sure you pay for everything you've done. Including a location in your prompt can help guide the model and prevent unwanted regional accents. This isn't the end. I'll make sure you pay for everything you've done. If you want a fixed camera shot with no movement, be sure to add this clearly in your prompt to prevent the AI from adding unwanted motion. The type of camera motion you choose depends on the scene you want to create. If you're using camera motion in your prompt, clearly define the movement and specify what the camera should focus on at the end of the shot. You can control the emotion and tone of the sound through clear and specific descriptions. Make sure to describe both the emotion and the exact sound you want to hear in your prompt. I warned you. This is on you. You think I won't pull the trigger?
If you don't describe the tone clearly, VO3 may deliver emotional dialogue like a song, especially in farewell scenes with strong emotions. See you later, my friend. I will miss you. See you later, my friend. I will miss you. To add music and sound effects in VO3, simply describe the type of sound you want in your prompt, whether it's background music, ambient noise, or character actions. The more specific and fitting your description, the better the audio result will be. Go to the Google Gemini subscription section to see available plans. The free plan does not include access to VO3. To use VO3 and Google Flow, you need the Google AI Pro plan, which also comes with a one-month free trial. For more access and usage, you can check out the Ultra plan. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more AI tutorials. Share your experiences and questions in the comment section. See you in the next tutorial.